Imagine you have your own web server on your Android phone. Hi and welcome back to another video. My name is Rod and in this video I want to teach you how to install WordPress web server on your Android phone. We want to have an environment to test and develop our website on our Android phone. Not on macOS, not on Windows. We want to bring our phone anywhere and type our phone IP, our local IP of our Android phone in any browser, any computer and access to our local host web server. Let's start. First of all, we have to go to Google Play, then search for web server and install a web server HTTP Apache PHP SQL application. It's free. Uh, maybe you have to see some ads to support this developer, but uh, you don't need to pay anything to use this application. For example, in KS web application, you have to pay for, for around 14 dirhams. It's around two, three to four dollars to uh, access the application after three, 30 days, I think. 15 to 30 days, yeah. But for a web server, you don't have to pay anything to use this application, this application features. After installing this application, you have to open it and do some settings on your web server. Open. It's extracting the components. Then we have to see some ads. Yeah. And you have to allow permission to all files on your phone. So then go back to application. We don't need to change anything here. Just select your document root, click internal. And then, for example, we can select any folder, any directory on our phone. For example, uh, for example, downloads, internal downloads. And yeah, I'm going to my files on my phone. I'm going to internal storage, download folder and create folder here. For example, host. Yes. Then I have to go to download and select host from here and select this document root. Now we have to start our service. So select start. Again, we have to see some ads from developer. Oh, stop. Okay, then I know what is Binance. Just skip this ads. Yeah, I know what is crypto. I've lost 50k last year. Finally. Wow. Service starts. Ah. What the? Wallah, I know what is noon. I'm ordering every day. Just skip this. What? Okay, finally, service is started. Now we have to go to MySQL and start MySQL service and play ads again and again and again. Ooh. Yeah, 
finally my, my MariaDB SQL server is running. Now I have my IP address 192.168.0.167 with 8080 port. So I can come here in my computer and enter this port with IP and now I can see index of in this document root which folder which directory host directory that I've selected in the previous steps and then I can enter this IP and port slash mysql admin and with username root and password root I can log into PHP my admin system here I can install I can create and manage my databases first of all to install WordPress on this web server I have to download WordPress so I'm going to Google Chrome and I am typing wordpress.org slash download to download WordPress download WordPress latest version then I have to go to my files and I, I have WordPress here let me select and remove all of these files yes now it's clear yeah uh, I'm opening WordPress and select extract to extract WordPress on my downloads in my downloads folder it's extracting now and after that I have to go to this folder select all WordPress files and copy all of these files to my document root which is host in my downloads folder yes I'm going to WordPress I'm selecting all files select copy and then I'm going back to download folder host directory and copy here I'm copying all of WordPress files here now I can see these files by refreshing this page here I'm waiting to complete the copying items yes I can uh, install WordPress through my my uh, my uh, my Google Chrome here on my computer or in my phone let's do it in my phone I'm going to localhost slash with my port slash mysql admin which is my PHP my admin with username root password root and select go I can go to databases section and enter my database name for example Ertano you can select your own database name and here in a character set or char set um, we have to select UTF-8 underline general underline CI and select create yes now I have to go to local host with port 8080 and install WordPress yes I'm selecting my language it's just United States English after installing you can go to general options in your WordPress panel and select every language you want continue it says uh, we need database information yes let's go I have database informations what my database name is Ertano my username is root my password is root and my database host is local host click on submit and we have error here no problem try again for database host I have to enter my IP address 192.168.0.167 0.167 this is my local host IP address submit run the installation it's done 
And here I have to complete my WordPress information, for example, website title, my username, which is admin, my password, which is almost admin in localhost. This is localhost, no problem. We can use very weak password. Your email address, for example, hi at ertano.com and install WordPress successfully. WordPress installed on your, your uh, mobile phone. Now we have access to our WordPress on our mobile phone, on our uh, browser. Just you have to connect your computer and your mobile phone on same Wi-Fi and then you can enter your local host IP uh, in any system, for example, your tablet, your laptop, your MacBook, your um, Windows laptop, doesn't matter, your PC. You can enter your IP and access to your local host. That's it. And we have installed WordPress on Android system. Good luck. Don't forget to subscribe in our YouTube channel, like our videos and make comments below. Thank you.